Hey, 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 it's the Toxic Ring Scandal. Give your RKO like Randall. Today, we're going to talk about when the USA Network threatened to cancel WWE Monday Night Raw. Now, this was back in the late 1990s during the Attitude Era. There were a lot of popular acts in the WWE, and then Generation X was one of them. The thing about it was they were doing a lot of crazy antics in the ring and doing segments and saying words that they shouldn't be saying. Now they came to the ring, they were always acting fool with the bananas, making jokes. You know, Shawn Michaels was the champion at the time and also European champion. So they were having lots of fun. They were having backstage segments, but it even got controversial. You can see here, Shawn Michaels is half naked right here. All they covering him is the WWE Championship. But Triple H did an interview a while back, and he stated that USA Network had to tell them to stop saying certain words after the WWE Raw is War part, then the War Zone after 9, 10 o'clock at night or 11 their time. They were allowed to say certain words, and Vince McMahon also warned them, and they kept doing it. They continued to say those words, and then Vince Triple H said that Vince McMahon has showed them emails and saying, "Hey, look at this. I warned you guys, and now we're being threatened to be canceled." So after that, they did a interview, a little, you know, state of the address. Saying they're not allowed to say certain words, but they did a comical form as the Generation X likes to do. So they stopped doing that and they toned down what they were doing because they could have lost the deal. That was a huge deal for WWE. They could have lost the USA Network deal, could have lost, you know, TV rights, everything. They would have nowhere to network their broadcast of WWE Monday Night Raw. And also, no, this was before WWE SmackDown. That debuted in 1999, and it first debuted on UPN. So they had no other shows at the time. So this was very, very big. This is why Monday Night Raw is still the number one flagship show for WWE today. It's been on so many years. It debuted in 1993. Just had 30th anniversary. Still going on today. But the Generation X, they were very monumental but they were taking it too far pushing the envelope saying things they shouldn't be saying on air tv these are lots of people at the time that are tuning in the demographic was very very good it wasn't just young adults watching it, it was little kids watching it as i was one of them at the time so this really affected the viewership for those saying those words on tv as WWE is nothing like that today, but back, <clears throat> back then it was like that. And Triple H stated that that stuff had to be stopped. Because Vince McMahon got tired of receiving the emails and all, you know, how upset the network was of what they was doing. So they, they had to they had to change it up. But nonetheless, the Generation X is still one of the best groups best stables of all time you know alongside other groups like nwo the four horsemen you know fabulous freebirds they're up there but that was the time that the usa network threatened to cancel wwe monday night raw and thank god that that never happened they still going on today and you guys let me know in the comment section below what you think of this did USA Network to stay the right, do the right thing to threaten them, or was they taking it too far? Until then, it is O U T.